top story, a man sits in the Harrison County Jail right now accused of smuggling people into the country right through where we live, stopped on I-20 heading eastbound, deputy say going to Atlanta, Georgia. KDK's Ashlyn Anderson right now joins us live with more about these arrests. Ashlyn, what can you tell me? Neil, Harrison County Chief Deputy Hall Revis says that besides the driver, there were five other people in the vehicle. Their ages range from 18 to 45. And the driver now identified as Benjamin Rios Perez was pulled over after driving in between lanes. Once the deputy started talking to him, he noticed that Perez was acting suspicious. It ultimately led to authorities to search the vehicle. Soon after, Rios Perez admitted to deputies that he was smuggling his passengers. They crossed over at the border and were headed from Texas to Georgia. The driver had charged $700 a head. It's something every week that we deal with, uh, lots of drugs every week, and it's uh, people would just be amazed to know. Chief Deputy Reves says that he's seeing a lot of smuggling cases connected to drugs. He's afraid that this smuggling case won't be the last. And Perez is charged with a third degree felony. His bond is not set yet, but ICE is working with the county to see what the next steps are for the other five individuals. Reporting in Harrison County, Ashlyn Anderson, KTK News. That is a huge story right there.